Uh, Eli and Logan rented it for the weekend. Apparently some crazy shit happened up there a long time ago. What happened? Well, I don't really know exactly, but Keanu knows the full story. She's Scared, yeah, I know. Ball scene Halloween more. I'm just glad we get to go up to the cabin and have an enjoyable Halloween weekend party with the boys. I stopped an old man along the way. Hoping to find some old forgotten words. So do I pay you now, or after you're dressed? Yeah, right, after my just witness, you should be paying me. Ouch, that would hurt if I actually gave a shit. Speaking of shit. Who's out there? Don't act like you haven't seen anyone take a shit in the Pringles can before. What the fuck are you? No! 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 Damien, where are you? Damien! Damien, I swear to God, if this is a prank, I'm gonna kill you. Wow, looks like the allergy medicine kicked in already. Oh my God.
that idiot better be ready. You told him a half hour ago. He should be. Whoa. Well, it's not creepy at all. You ready? You ready to go to the cabin yet or what? Dude, Elena just broke up with me. I don't think I'm coming. Well, by the looks of this place, it looks like all you've been doing is coming. Dude, me and Logan ran a cabin up at Longhorn Lake this weekend. Grab your shit and forget about that bitch for one weekend. I can't go on without her. I just want to end it all. Just think about all the babes out of the lake this weekend. Don't forget about her in no time. Yeah, come on, Austin. Plus, we're having an Evil Dead marathon. You guys are right. She's not that hot to begin with. Alright, boys. Let's get this show on the road. Can't wait to see what this cabin looks like. It's so nice. Woo. Dude, I gotta take a shit. What's with you and your brother always having to take a shit? <laughs> we just had T-Bell. I think everybody has to. Hey, Blade, there's a gas station up ahead. Let's stop there. Fritos, dip, uh, beef jerky, two Kit Kats, some marshmallows, and make sure you get a Rockstar Fruit Punch. All right. And whatever you guys want.
boys let's get this party started played my asses in my chin the sooner we get out the better played the car's nice but man is it shit for space speaking of shit have you guys seen this cabin i'm surprised damien even came up here considering how bad his allergies get oh yeah where is your brother shouldn't he and chelsea be here by now well they got all the halloween decorations set out already but their car's gone so i'm guessing they went into town Nice. What do you think, boys? Honestly, it sucks. How much do you guys pay for this place? Uh, fifteen hundred. Like. A year? All bling, I think you should go and grab the TV for the Evil Dead marathon later. No, no balls. balls! Well, let's get these snacks ready and stuff. I'm gonna look at that piece cutter. Alright. Hey, Austin. Throw on some toys while we unpack. I didn't bring much, so I'll get the food ready for the Evil Dead marathon. Say no more.
right, boys, pizza's in. Should be done in about 20 minutes. Nice. Hell yeah. So what was that story you were talking about? Oh, okay. Well, it all started in 1978. There were bullfights close to here, and the matadors would come to this very lake a few days before to party, drink, have some fun before the fights. That year, a newcomer was favorited to win the fights, and the other matadors decided to pull a prank on him. They got him blackout drunk, stole and killed a bull that was supposed to be used for the fights. They decapitated it, carved out its head, and placed it on top of the matadors. Now what they did next would end up being the biggest mistake of their lives. What happened? Hogan, shut the fuck up. I'm gonna finish the goddamn story. Anyways, a couple of the matadors took him back to the bullpen and threw him in. They armed him with a scimitar and told him, if you want to fight with the bulls, you gotta be the bull. Well, it didn't take long as you'd expect, and the other bulls gored the matador to death. And the fights that year were canceled. The body was never found, and the fights went on as normal the following year. The matadors returned to this very lake, not caring about last year's events. And what happens next still gives me the chills. Bullshit. Why would there be a bull fighting in the middle of Wisconsin? Shut the hell up, Lee. Yeah. Money money ever a good time. Let him finish the goddamn story. Okay, so that night, the matador returned to the cabin, only he wasn't human anymore. He was still wearing the outfit from the night he died, except now, the bull head had replaced his own. He killed every last matador, armed with the very scimitar that was supposed to save his life. Now every year, around this time, anyone who comes to this lake faces the wrath of the bull. Ah! Ah! Here, you idiot, make me hungry. <laughs> Eli, what does it make you hungry? Shut up, Blake. Go check on pizza. Since I came up here, I'm taking at least half this pizza. Alright, now where is that pizza cutter at? Guys, where's that pizza cutter at? Guys, where's the pizza ah! I swear he could get killed for real, no one would even know. Maybe it was the bull. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Fucking wimp. Where's Eli with that pizza? I'm starting to get hungry. He probably ate it. He left him in charge of cooking. I'll go check on him. He probably started cooking another one for himself. You guys are always making fun of him for his weight. You know how sensitive he is. Alright, alright. I'll go check on him. Guys, you need to get up here right now. Hurry. Wow. Look at all this work you put in, just to try and scare us. You know, even those fingers like they're actually cut off. How do you do this? Guys, I don't think this is a prank. Look, the pizza's still here. 
There's not a single bite taken out of it. Fuck you guys. I think we need to call the police. I didn't unpack my phone, neither you? Yeah, I'll take care of it. Just give me a minute. Wait. Is now seriously the time for food? My brother just died. Eating's the best way I know to pay my respects to your brother. Nay. Plus, Keanu's over there taking a selfie with him. What the fuck, Keanu? What? i never seen a dead body before. And for the record, I would have taken a picture with any of you. And if I was the one who died, I would expect you guys to do the same. You know, he's got a point. My turn. Someone just called the goddamn police already? Jesus Christ. Yeah, not me. I'm already on it, guys. Shut up, it's ringing. 911, what's your emergency? Hey, we're out here at Longhorn Lake and one of our friends just died. What happened? Well, it looks like he slipped and fell face first into a pizza cutter. Give me that. What? Not that. Yeah, it looks like my brother was murdered. We need someone out here right away. Okay, it'll have to wait until tomorrow. Everyone went home for the night. I will send my two best officers first thing in the no. morning. No, wait, 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 you don't understand. What? Hello? Great. Guess murder means nothing in this town. Ew! Sarge is being away from me. Alright, boys, to get your spot, I'm about to put on Army of Darkness. Yeah. Yeah, alright. Just give me a minute. Gonna miss you, brother. I'll promise you this. I'll find whoever did this. They'll pay. you aren't expecting the 10 queen 2 combo in which I will 69 myself. Your turn. Yeah? Well, I match your 2 whatever 10 combo with 2 aces. You know, that is a smart move. Yeah, I'll, I will give you that. But you aren't ready for the double 5 4 combo, meaning I win. Here's the side door. That one sucks. Seems to be the problem here, boys. Uh, our friend just died. His body is literally right next to you. Do you have any idea what happened? We were down by the campfire, and we heard a scream. And after it just been too long, and we came up here to check on him. And this is how we found him. So you found him under a blanket, with a vape on top. No dumbass, we did that out of respect. Watch your mouth, boy. We'll get to the bottom of this. Got the two best officers in town. So what the fuck are you two gonna do about it? We're gonna check the perimeter, see if there's any clues. Be back in about 30 minutes. You guys just sit tight. Got it. Thanks, Deputy Jim and Sheriff Faye Goot. Hey! It's Faye! I didn't come to this cabin to be disrespected by a bunch of fucking kids! <laughs> Kevin, calm down, man. Remember 
heard the doctor said about your blood pressure. Sorry, guys. We'll be back in 30 minutes. Uh, thanks, officers, but you guys sure you don't need any uh, extra muscle? We're sure. Well, boys, what do we do now? Uh, Wanna watch a movie? Sure, I guess. I mean, we gotta kill some time until those cops get back. Kinda. You just missed the cops, actually. They went to go search the woods to find any clues about your brother's killer. Uh, good. Glad someone's doing something. Oh. We're gonna watch a movie. You wanna watch one? I mean, we do have Monopoly out. It's Eli's favorite board game. You wanna play one in his memory, maybe? Sure. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Well, my call I gonna be the iron, cause, uh, they're the one who pumps iron. Uh, Play, you actually get to be the dog because you're a little bitch. <laughs> hey, fuck you guys, all right? You already know what piece I'm gonna be. I always got the shoe with me. <laughs> all right, guys, slow down. Let's get this going. Exactly. Anything suspicious? Or the ordinary? You think it was him? Who? The bull. Don't you dare speak that name around here! It's just a myth. But your father, didn't he get the call? I'll tell you this once. My father was the best sheriff this town ever had. And even he had not been prepared for the call he received October 1978. He was the first on the scene. That's all I gotta say, boy. Sorry to bring up your... Hey, what's that over there? What is it? It's bullshit. <laughs> oh, all right, boys. Lucky like roll coming up. All right. The low matures collect hundred and fifty dollars. Not bad. At least it wasn't on boardwalk. For the money, it is. Fuck money. Eh, yeah, I'm not too mad. Not the first time I've been in jail. Blade, you went to jail for stalking. Not that impressive. Anything but a three. What are their chances? Hate Monopoly. Eight bucks. Thanks, idiot. Oh, 
Oh, I'm thirsty. You guys want anything to drink? Yeah, I'll take a Red Bull, man. I'm good. No. Oh, fuck, that's good. Hey, Lauren, could you please move my piece 12 places? Fine. What the fuck? Is this Eli's fucking finger? Oh, uh, yeah. It's not like he was using it anymore. You know what? Fuck you guys! Logan! Logan, where are you at, man? Hey, if this is about Eli's finger, I can give it back to him. That was a good game of Monopoly, too. I was winning. No, oh, man, that was my win. Blade, you were in jail, no money, shit properties. You were not winning. You never know, dude. Don't call me dude. Not a skater anymore. Not since. Sometimes I try to do things, and it just doesn't work out the way I want it to. And I get real frustrated. They're like, I try hard to do it, and I like take my time, but it just doesn't work out the way I want it to. It's like I concentrate on real hard, but it just doesn't work out. And everything I do and everything I try, it never turns out. It's like, I need time to figure these things out. There's always someone there going, hey Mike, you know, we've been noticing you've been having a lot of problems lately, you know? You need to maybe get away. And like, maybe you should talk about it, you'll feel a lot better. And I go, no, it's okay, you know, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out, you know? I'm just working on it myself. They go, well, you know, if you want to talk about it, I'll be here, you know? And you'll probably feel a lot better if you talk about it. So why don't you talk about it? I go, no, I don't want to. I'm okay. I'll figure it out myself. And they just keep bugging me. They just keep bugging me. There's pills on the side. It's got to be a suicide. So come and pray with my side. You will not have any say. I'll pray with you to see the way. I'm not drinking. I was in my room, and I was just like staring at the wall, thinking about everything, standing down, yeah, I was thinking about nothing. And then my mom came in, and I didn't even know she was there. She called my name, and I didn't hear her, and then she started screaming, Mike, Mike! And I go, what? What's the matter? She goes, what's the matter with you? I go, there's nothing wrong, Mom. She goes, don't tell me that. You're on drugs. I go, no, Mom, I'm not on drugs. I'm okay. I'm just thinking, you know? Why don't you give me a Pepsi? She goes, no, you're on drugs. I go, Mom, I'm okay. I'm just thinking. She goes, no, you're not thinking, you're on drugs. No, no, people don't act that way. I go, Mom, just give me a Pepsi, please. All I want is a Pepsi. And she wasn't giving me. Yeah. Oh, shit, God. Ah. I can see flashbacks. Okay, well, what do we do now? Shouldn't those cops be back yet? Yeah, you know, it has been a long time. Maybe we should go take a look around this place. Sounds good. I'll well, search the woods. You know, you can search the lake, and what about you, Austin? I guess I'll just stay here and wait for Logan or the cops to get back. All right, well, let's meet back here in about 20 minutes to check in with each other.
How could they disrespect you like that? Take all this time, rent the cabin, try to have a good time this weekend. They just laugh when you die. It's been like a whole day now. I just keep asking myself, why couldn't it have been played? Austin? Austin! Oh, I swear to God, if you guys are pulling another prank, I'll kill you myself. Austin? Hey, Austin? Oh. Must be one of those stupid cops. Who's out there? Something is seriously fucking wrong here. I gotta get back to the cabin. It's you, isn't it? The bull? You're the one that killed my brother. You took my brother from me. Now I... Pizza together. Oh, this is too perfect. Dude, you got me good. So I don't know what's worse, that mask or this cabin. My God, that is awful. The worst quality mask I've ever seen. Holy shit. I know, right? I picked it up at that gas station where we met that creepy old guy. So why do you even have a Halloween mask on you anyways? I mean, we all came up here for a Halloween party, right? Oh, yeah. What the fuck? Hello? Hey, did you guys uh, find anything or anyone? No, man, I searched this whole lake and found nothing. It's like this place is deserted. Yeah, I found nothing either. But uh, I looked at my GPS. Looks like there's a police station a mile and a half away. You want me to see if we can get any more cops out here? No, let's just sit around here and wait to die. You know, you don't need to be so rude. Looks like there's a shortcut through the woods. Why don't you just take your car? It's literally right outside. Nah, I'd rather walk. It's not like you two would have any idea what exercise feels like. God, I wish Blade would have died instead. Blade, stalking girls and running away once they spot you does not count as exercise. You know, it takes things too far sometimes. It was one girl, multiple times. If they would have started with that red hair, they would have stalked her too. Seriously? That douche Blade just hung up on me. If the killer doesn't kill Blade, I'm gonna end up doing it myself. Well, what do we do now? I guess we can watch the rest of Halloween and see if Blade comes back with any more cops. Okay, but can we leave the lights on, please? Uh, it's still daylight out, but I guess. Alright. Time feels like I'm the one being stopped. So you're the bull, huh? You're gonna butcher me like you did my friend? Or you're gonna fight me like a man? If there's any man left in you.
You heard the old phrase. If you mess with the bull, you get the horns. Well, I mess with the bull. Except you got the blaze! Damn, what a classic, true. I'm gonna still need these lights on when I go to sleep though. Just be careful, Austin. You never know who's out there, dude. Don't, you need more of an asshole than Blade. Speaking of Blade, where's that little douchebag at? It's been 39 minutes and 52 seconds. Well, that was oddly specific, but I think something's wrong here. Blade, Logan, or the cops aren't back yet. Yeah, you're right. We should head to the police station. Maybe Logan and Blade are waiting for us there. Okay, Austin, I need you to get the gas. And I see Blade left his keys on the couch. That douchebag on the phone earlier was grossing us about not exercising and you don't know what a workout is. And he left his fucking keys on the couch. Wow. Poor move. All right, let's do this. flashlight. Let's see you get through that. Three minutes? Is that Bruce Campbell? Oh no, his name's Fred. Gotta 
record this. Why is it black? Oh, oh shit, my finger was covering it. This is far from over. Watch out! 